welcome back to my channel. So if you're new to my channel, I'd like to say hello. My name is Ali, Alyssa, whichever one you want to call me, or Alyssa, my actual name. Um, and if you're a returner, hey boo. So in today's video, I'm going to be answering just 13 random questions. Tag, um, I found this tag on the internet when I was scrambling to think of an idea to film. So I will leave the link to the tag down below, so check the description box for it. And I tag everybody who's watching this to do this video. To answer these questions. So the question is on my phone, so I'm going to be looking on my phone. Okay. So if you would like to, you know, learn a little bit more about me through these questions, just keep on watching. So the first question of this tag is, what do you order at Starbucks? Currently, the black community, basically everybody, but mostly the black community, is boycotting Starbucks because of what they did in Philadelphia. If you don't know, I've been living under a rock. Two guys who turned out to be real estates were waiting at Starbucks and they was arrested and thrown in jail for what? Sitting while black. They was waiting for a friend and somebody called the cops on them. Cops showed up. It took five people, five cops to arrest two calmly peaceful black dudes, right? Yeah. The odds. And so we are boycotting Starbucks. I don't even like Starbucks anyway. So, yeah, I'm not. Basically, I don't order nothing. And you shouldn't be ordering anything if you look like me. So, number two. What's one thing in your closet that you cannot live without? One thing in my closet I cannot live without is my denim jacket. It keeps me nice and stylish when it's summertime, when it's fall, when it's that weather. Like, do I bring out my heavy coat or can I still rock my denim jacket and probably just a scarf? Oh, excuse me. My denim jacket. Any denim jacket would do. Number three. What's one thing that most people probably wouldn't know about you? <sighs> hmm. One thing most people wouldn't know about me is... Hmm. Probably that I don't... Hmm. I feel like if you don't know me, you probably don't know this about me. Hmm. But it's either that I really don't like TV, watching television, or, um, probably that. I don't know. I feel like I'm an open book, so if you don't know something about me, I wouldn't know. But I think that's probably what people don't know about me, is that I don't like television. I don't really watch it, unless I'm watching, like, One Order, Grey's Anatomy. Or the news. That's basically all I watch on television. Um, or this is us, but it's not on anymore. Um, number four. Name one thing that you want to do before you die. One thing that I would like to do before I die is to travel around the world. Where it doesn't matter. Um, hopefully, I'm with my significant other, or my family, or my friends. But that's one thing I want to do, is just to travel around the world. Number six. What quote slash phrase do you live your life by? Um, the most famous quote that I say is, it is what it is. And I feel like I live my life like that because I feel like people are so fixated on trying to like change something that is already set change something that they've done, change something that, you know, you can't change. So if you can't change something, it is what it is. People just need to accept that. And I try to live by that, you know. I can't change what is unchangeable or what's out of my hands, basically. So. Hmm. Number seven, what do you like and dislike about the YouTube community? What I like about the YouTube community is that it's so big like it's so big there's like literally a video a video there is literally a video on everything on YouTube um I like the little communities and like the little 
you know, I don't know, the culture. I like it. One thing I don't like about YouTube is how they be trying to play the small channels or like how um, I could put up a video and somebody, you know, porcelain like, you know, you know, the other side could put on the same exact video and like, they gravitate more towards them. I feel like black people on YouTube are just not, you know, they're not doing as much as they could, not they, but YouTube, you know, they're not giving them the same opportunity, so, that's the one thing I don't like about YouTube, but for the most part, I feel like I really love it, and it's good, but we just gotta work a lot harder, not me, because I barely do, I barely do videos, I'm not a part of that, but I've seen, like, people who've been working hard for years are struggling to get to, like, 100,000 subs. And, you know, your little sister and brother and will put up, like, barely any content. And they just get more, you know, views, more subscribers. It's just, it's, it's not fair. But the world's not fair. And it is what it is. So you just fuck up and move forward. <sighs> the next question is, what's your number one most listened to song on iTunes? So, I'm not sure what song is, uh, can I see that on my phone? My most played? Hmm. I don't know how to check that on my phone. I don't know, to be honest. I will look it up and I'll put it on the screen. Mark to the tag. What kind of style would you define yourself as hat fit? I have um, affordable style, which is like, I don't try to look expensive. I just wear clothes that is, you know, affordable and cute and that I like for my body. So I don't know what type of style that is. But the affordable, you know, don't want to spend money, don't care about labels, but still want to queue. We're trying to save money style. What, whatever that style is, that's what I am. Um, number nine, what kind of, oh, I did that already. Number ten, favorite number. My favorite number is 729. I know that's a big number. Most people either give you a one-digit number or a two-digit number. But 729 stands for my birthday, July 29th. So yes, that's my favorite number. Um, two hobbies. My two hobbies is watching YouTube videos and sleeping. You can catch me doing both most of the time if I'm not busy doing other stuff. So basically watching YouTube videos or sleeping or talking to me. Or talking to my girlfriend all day. So, I will. That's what I like doing. Two pet peeves. My pet peeves is one is somebody that cuts me off when I'm talking. That is literally my biggest pet peeve. And second one is people who drag their feet when they walk. I cannot stand it. Pick up your feet when you walk. Pick it up. It irritates me. Little kids do that. People I know do not ground the people, they drag their feet when they walk. And that's literally the sound that it makes is my soul dying. You know, that scraping sound? That's the scraping pieces of my soul. Because that's, oh, I hate that. Pick up your feet, people. Um, and the last question is guilty pleasures. I don't have no guilty pleasure. If I like something, I like it and I don't feel guilty about it. So. That's basically all the questions. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. And while you're here, like I said, please hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to touch that bell so you are notified whenever I upload. Make sure you check out the description box below because I will have the link to these questions. As well as other tags you guys can pick from. This is just the tag that seemed more appealing to me. But on this website they have a bunch of different tags for you to choose for so I'll have that link down below as well as the questions I will have them posted down below and while you're in the description box make sure you follow me on my social media follow me on my Instagram and my snapchat so you are connected 
you can see what I'm doing when I'm not on YouTube. I'm always on social media, so follow me, mostly on Snapchat, you know, slide through my DMs, try to be friends. I'm all about being friends. Let's make be friends 2018, you know? Okay, so that's basically it. I hope you guys um, have a good day, good night, or whatever time it is. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.